money, hold up, gotta cut up, lot of so what's up y'all it's a new video and as you guys are by the title i'm going to be taking you guys hygiene shopping with me the girl is going on vacation in two days it's for my birthday trip or whatever i literally just ran out of everything so i was like why not take you guys along with me when i'm doing my hygiene shopping i'm gonna put you guys on to my favorite products we're gonna be hitting up target sephora and ulta and maybe cvs today and i'm gonna just put y'all on to the goods if you want to smell good or whatever so yeah if you're new to my channel welcome if you're returning what's good sis you feel me so we're at a target right now and i think i'm gonna head to starbucks because what's a target run without a starbucks run you know and luckily for me the starbucks is right across from the target hi right, can i get an iced caramel macchiato with three tons of sugar-free vanilla and can i get a order of egg white bites okay that's all for today 12.19 thank you oh wait i gotta pay here too right i'll be forgetting <laughs> I'm about to sit here and grab my food because I'm so used to like Chick-fil-A drive throughs I don't go to Starbucks drive throughs And Chick-fil-A drive throughs they just take the money when you order. Okay, okay, okay. Is it really rainy? Y'all, I got a confession to make. I'm not a Starbucks girly at all whatsoever. <laughs> Y'all heard how basic my order was, right? I really was just in the mood for coffee. Like, I'm not gonna lie. I was just like, let me enter this, you know, rich housewife alter ego. Cause like I felt like I was already 50% there when I put on some Lululemon instead of some sweats. Like I was like, okay, yeah, you know, it's slowly activating. And I saw Starbucks. I was like, you know what? Let me get some Starbucks as well. You know? You want a straw? Yes, please. Thank you. I was basically like, let me get bougie housewife today. I love it. Egg white bites smell so freaking good. I'm not gonna lie. I'm gonna eat some before I go because what? Let's taste this drink. Yeah. These are so freaking good, oh my god. Ten piece, lemon, 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 pepper, wings, stop. Yeah, we lemon, pepper, stepping. I was overthinking, he was so refreshing, my bad. I'm just trying to get it set. So we made it to Target and we are currently on our way to the hygiene aisle. Currently looking for it, actually. Since when Target had Curology? My favorite soap to use, I tell you guys this all the time, is by Dr. Bronner's, the Pure Castile Peppermint Soap, and I love it so much. I currently have the big ones, I don't need another big one, but I think I'm gonna take a smaller one. This is my favorite soap to use. It's the only soap that makes me feel like 100% clean. Like, every time I take a shower with this, I feel 100% clean, like, no ifs, ands, or buts. They also have different scents. My second favorite is the eucalyptus one. That one also gives you like that minty feel, like you feel clean after. But my favorite one is the Dr. Bronner's peppermint soap so I'm gonna get a small so we're in the feminine care products aisle now and I want to put you guys on to a new feminine wash that I've been using for like two months now and I really really like it I'm currently still testing out different feminine washes to see which works for me but I'm not gonna lie y'all this one has it this is the wash that I've been using it's the down there wash it's by the brand good wipes I believe and I also have their down there wipes as well when I tell you this wash is amazing this is the one that I was using this is the V fresh one and they also have a rose water one I've never tried the rose water one so I think I might pick this one up it's an aloe based cleanser and it's perfect for those who have like sensitive skin or whatever because I have sensitive skin especially down there I don't want nothing that's too fragrant it smells like aloe and my homegirl likes it so I definitely recommend you guys trying this out also the wipes are a1 I keep the wipes in my bag at all times like so good definitely recommend you guys trying this out getting both because I need to re-up on both so yeah so when it is that time of the month that I'm a pads girl like I don't do the tampons like I just can't I really just can't so my very pads to use are actually by honey pot don't call me a freak anything like that but I specifically like the mint pads <laughs> I specifically like the mint pads because I just love like that minty tingly feeling that is so TMI but it feels so soothing also the mint makes me feel cleaner I don't want to get too into it but you guys know when you're on your cycle you don't always feel the best or the cleanest i don't know if it's just me but it just feels really really nice and soothing and like good that's basically what i'm trying to say like i'm not trying to get too tmi but these are my favorite pads to use the honey pot mint pads okay let me go to the next section because i'm getting too into it so far we have our body wash as well as some feminine products there's also another body wash that i love but i'm looking for it and i can't seem to find it 
Also, I'm looking for the deodorant aisle because the deodorant that I'm gonna put you guys onto, A1, okay? A freaking one. My newly found secret to deodorizing like your full body. And the product is by Loom. It's their whole body deodorant. I've been using this deodorant, you guys, and when I tell you this deodorant literally works, it's not deodorant that I use underneath my underarms. I use this in between my thighs, underneath my rolls, underneath my fupa, like anywhere where it's very, very like cramped basically not cramped you guys but any area of my body that sweats a lot or is more prone to odor and that's typically in between my thighs underneath folds or whatever so this deodorant is literally the best deodorant for that it is the loom whole body deodorant for pits privates and beyond so you can put this in between your booty cheeks or anywhere that you know sweats a lot or doesn't get that much air you know so this is the cream version and this is the stick version i prefer the cream version because i can just easily rub it into my skin i'm mean, literally the same exact thing you guys so it doesn't really matter my favorite scent is the unscented one because i feel like the other scents can be a bit overpowering i'm not gonna lie so i always just reach for the unscented and they have a bigger tube as well but i don't know where that's at in target i've never been able to get the big tube at target only this size tube right here but you can always order it off of amazon so i will link the one from amazon and i will link the one from target as well but this is a holy grail product right here must have like if you have any odor put this on it's literally blocking it like that odor is no longer like and it has 72 hour protection this sounds like a whole ad for them but i promise you it works so well we're also in the shaving section as well if you guys don't know i get laser hair removal done so i rarely shave or wax the only time i shave is right before my laser hair removal appointment and my favorite razor to use like i could not this is my favorite razor to use is by flamingo like i love this razor so much i currently have a lot of peach fuzz because like i said i get laser so i don't really grow hair like that anymore but i realized with other razors they don't get that much of a close shave but flamingo does also another brand that i really do like is harry's that's a men's razor i love that because it really gets a smooth clean shave these two shavers right here a1 okay i don't need a new shaver right now because i have like a whole pack at home also i'm not due for another laser appointment until like may so i'm gonna put these back but i wanted to put you guys on to it so yeah and y'all know for deodorant i'm a dove girl this is the deodorant that i always use this is the Dove Even Tone deodorant. I've been using this for years and I, and I feel like it's helped even out my underarms. My underarm complexion is even. I've been using this product for years and it definitely does work. In the summertime though, when it gets like hot and it's like you sweating everywhere. Oh, let me tell you guys the deodorant that I use then. I use a secret clinical deodorant, y'all. This deodorant, when I tell you, it don't matter how much I sweat. When I use this deodorant in the summertime, I do not stink, I don't smell musty, nothing, okay? Like, this literally works so well, you guys. I'm not too sure which one I have at home because like I said, this is not the one that I use every day. This is the one that I use mainly like the summertime. But I believe they all work the same. I could be wrong though. But anything from the secret clinical line, A1. A freaking one, okay? This Target really got everything locked up. Like, it's not even funny. Do two all the these, still not a Target. Target got everything locked up, so now I have to wait for somebody to come. But I'm about to pick up my face wash. It is the Panoxu face wash. Literally the best thing ever. If you guys already watched my videos, you guys already know I love me some Panoxu. It is literally the only face wash that has helped my acne. Like, I do not break out at all anymore. Literally the best face wash. I use the Panoxu 10% benzoyl peroxide. Love it so freaking much. I know some people also use Use this underneath the underarms like using it as a mask and it helps with, like odor I've never tried that you don't only have to use this on your face you can use this on your body as well if you have like any body acne for me it's literally a holy girl product like it's helped treat my acne and I'm a continuously buy it because y'all i love it so we're in the oral section right now and you guys know i'm big on oral care like i do not play when it comes to my teeth at all i've been going back and forth with two different toothpaste the other toothpaste is not here for some reason i don't know why i don't think every target has it but the other one is and it's by paradontax if you guys have watched like my previous like shower routine you guys would have heard me talk about paradontax before and i love their toothpaste like i feel like my mouth feels super duper clean whenever i use their toothpaste and my favorite mouthwash i told you guys this is by thoroughbreath I like the invigorating icy mints. I love this one so much. You use it before you brush your teeth and then after you brush your teeth. I love this mouthwash because it doesn't have that burning feeling like other mouthwashes do and it still leaves your breath feeling very, very clean, smelling very, very clean, like the best mouthwash out, period, okay? You guys know I had Invisalign and I have a fixed retainer in my mouth, so I'm always flossing my teeth. If I'm not flossing with a water flosser, I literally have the Grin Floss Picks on deck at all times. It's always in my bag, like I literally cannot live without these. I don't like having food in my mouth 
at all whatsoever. These are my two favorites by the brand. This, this is the smooth floss pick and this is the double floss pick. I like this one a lot because it gets like all the meat, everything out your teeth. If I'm flossing after I brush my teeth, I typically use this, but I have this one in my bag at all times. If I need to have floss picks in my bags at all times, I don't like having food in my mouth. Also when you floss, you're doing your gums a favor and you won't have leftover food in your freaking mouth. That also is the reason why your breath be stinking, like straight up. Brushing and using mouthwash is not just it. You have to actually floss. But like I said, when I'm not water flossing, I use floss picks. These are my favorite ones, like I love it. So freaking much. Gotta pick up some Aquaphor because Aquaphor is what I use when I don't have on like lip gloss or any type of like lipstick on or whatever. It's the best thing for your lips, like period, okay? So I'm gonna target by the head to check out real quick and then we're gonna go to Ulta next. I think I already have the stuff that I was gonna re-up on in Ulta, so I'll just go to Sephora instead. So let's go to check out. back in the car you guys i've never been in the target for that long but i got a lot of the stuff that i needed because like i told you guys i was running low on almost everything so now i'm gonna type in the nearest sephora i'm going to listen to some music and vibe out okay because like i said we got a ride ahead of us so i'm always so i'm loving my beans if i was bitches i'd hate me a lot We've made it to Rich Hill, the Sephora that I like to go to. It's very quiet. So we've made it into Sephora, you guys. I'm gonna show you guys a few of my favorite body care products. Not necessarily skincare, because I don't really use that many items for my skincare. My favorite exfoliating scrub, I kid you not, is the Fresh Brown Sugar Body Scrub. This is literally the best exfoliator out, you guys. Like, I promise you, it exfoliates your skin so well. After you use the sugar scrub, your skin is gonna be feeling so soft and supple. Like, it is a bit expensive, I'm not gonna lie. But this is so worth the investment you guys like after using this one time you're gonna be hooked i promise you because that's how it was for me if you guys have any hyperpigmentation or dark spots on your body the brand that you have to check out is topicals i love topicals and if you guys stay to the end of the video i have a giveaway for you guys if you know you know i love their brightening and clear mist you guys i have dark spots all over my legs because i'm allergic to mosquito bites and when i was younger i would scratch them left heavy heavy scars so i've been using topicals products specifically the brightening and clearing mist on my legs and when i tell you i've seen a difference in the dark spots y'all this is so freaking good i'm pretty sure that you guys heard about the faded cream i use this on my skin i don't know if you guys could tell a difference if you're new here you probably won't know the difference but if you guys have been watching my channel for at least like a year or two now you guys will see a big difference in my skin like last year i was breaking out like crazy it has so many dark spots and my skin is so much clearer and brighter now and it's because of this so definitely come check out topicals so i actually won't be purchasing anything today from sephora because i actually have some products left over i have a whole nother bottle of the brown sugar scrub and i also have mad topical items so yeah we're not gonna be purchasing anything today but i really wanted to come to sephora and let you guys know about the products that i always have to re-up on whenever i come to sephora so yeah i'm currently at rite aid we're going to rite aid for two products it's one product that i want to try and then the other is my holy grail moisturizers and those will be the last two items that i need to pick up for the rest of the day i'm in the uh, moisturizer section my favorite moisturizer that i've been using since i was a kid like since i was like two years old it's Palmer's Cocoa Butter. I got the regular Palmer's Cocoa Butter, but I've never seen the Coconut Hydrate Body Balm. I feel like that'll really moisturize my skin, but this one right here is my go-to. I literally always use this one. I picked up the smaller size because like I said, I'm traveling. I don't want to carry the big jar with me. I'm going to try the Coconut Hydrate today because I really want to try it. So yeah, I'll let you guys know. I'm in the Feminine Wash aisle, and it was this particular Feminine Wash that I was looking for. It was the VH Essentials Feminine Wash. I've been hearing so many great reviews about it, and I wanted to try try it but this friday doesn't have it so i'm like i might just order it online or check cvs but i don't feel like doing that today we're only gonna get the cocoa butter today from rite aid but i was really hoping that they had the vh essentials but i'm about to head home now so i'll talk to you guys when we get home i made it back home you guys i would do a haul of everything that i got but everything that i showed you guys with the exception of the stuff that i said i'm not purchasing 
I already have or I purchased today so yeah everything that I showed you guys are items that I actually use I really don't see the need and doing a whole haul of everything that I purchased today but like I said this video does have a giveaway if you guys aren't following me and haven't been kept up with what's been going on your girl received some unexpected packages coincidentally they're skincare packages they're actual items that I use they're from topicals and good molecules I'm choosing five people to win this giveaway all you have to do is comment your favorite hygiene product it does not have to be anything that I mentioned today your favorite hygiene product your holy girl product something that you can't live without comment that and also put your instagram right next to your answer so i can get in contact with the winners but you will be winning one good molecules discoloration correcting serum one good molecules nice and mind brightening toner and a topicals faded brightening and clearing serum okay so for my julie dens with any hyperpigmentation or dark spots these are the products for you they will definitely help but yeah you guys this is the end of the video i hope you guys enjoyed it let me know in the comments if you did typically i would just do a shower routine of my favorite items and i still might not gonna lie because i have all these new products now you feel me also i have more products that i order online only that i can't get in store so that shower routine will have all of my faves in one video so let me know if you guys would like to see that i love you julian so much and i will see you guys in my next one bye